Hi, I'm Stephanie and this is Faith in 50. Yesterday we talked about how the opposition was looking for Stephen to mess up, and we find ourselves in Acts 6, 11 through 15. Then they secretly enticed some people to claim, we heard him insult Moses and God. They stirred up the people, the elders and legal experts. They caught Stephen, dragged him away, and brought him before the Jerusalem council. Before the council, they presented false witnesses who testified. This man never stopped speaking against this holy place in the law. In fact, we heard him say that this man, Jesus of Nazareth, will destroy this place and alter the customary practices Moses gave us. Everyone seated in the council stared at Stephen, and they saw that his face was radiant, just like an angel. It's hard to face lies and misinterpretations. Stephen seems to be up for quite the challenge. Yet even through these accusations, his face was radiant. He knew the truth in his heart. How does that sit with you? Is it enough for you to know the truth? Or are we still worried about how others interpret our lives? What misgivings or fals falsities are holding you back? How can we work on finding comfort in the truth and in God's faithfulness?